Hey everyone, today I want to share with you um, really just something that's that's taking place in my life right now and it might be taking place in yours as well. But just recently I just realized that I have not been completely honoring God in every area of my life. That actually it might seem silly to many of you but in the area of food that I have been overindulging in and, and I realize that that's a sin against God and it's it's hurt me so deeply not because I messed up or anything like that but but it's it's because I learned that when I read Ephesians chapter 4 it says do not grieve the Holy Spirit of God and then as I looked up that word grieve it it it, it says that it's a it's an emotional experience that's equivalent to ch giving childbirth so in other words that when we sin we give God such a th basically the most extreme painful emotional experience possible to see that God hurts whenever we, we sin against Him. And it's not just a matter of us messing up or, oh, this is just a little sin or whatever it may be. But, I mean, I just, I've just been crying before the Lord because I realize that this is not something that is pleasing to Him at all. And maybe you're in the same boat that, that there's something that goes on in your life and, and you feel like God is like distant and he like doesn't want to be close to you and I, I promise that's a lie and he's hurting for you and he wants to be close for you all it takes is for us to admit that we were wrong to admit that we've been hurting him and to actually want to to change our lives and to walk away from those areas and so for me personally I'm committing to really just I want to deny my flesh as much as possible I want to be able to tell my body no I want it to be able to tell it yes and so uh, I'm going to be uh, really just just diving deep into to fasting and into praying and to really just get on top of of the flesh in my life and I want to be able to continue to walk in the spirit of God and I, I don't want to hurt God any longer and so I hope this encourages you guys or maybe this this helps you guys that if you're in a tough place know that you're not alone in it and that that God wants to help you to get through it he's already broken the chains all you have to do is accept that and if you guys have any questions or anything I'd love to be able to help out I hope you guys have a great day and I hope this helped.